Jorge from Team JBS giving you a quick exclusive of the TV show that's coming out called Metal Man. We were able to screen this um, when it came out on South by Southwest um, and the premise of this show is basically uh, follow Henry a handyman who looks like a deaf metal band member as he is called to fix a bathtub for a young couple he gets involved in their drama but in spite of this scary uh, exterior, he helps them with his kind nature. Um, and that's kind of about it. But this one, it, it's actually pretty, it's unique. And it's a cool, cool premise. So you have this dude who, you know, obviously Henry, who by by just looking at him, just looks menacing. Like, um... I think he's like seven feet tall, you know, tatted up all over, long hair. Like if you think death metal, like that's exactly what you're getting. Um, but he's almost like this peaceful giant in this show. So he gets called uh, to fix this lady's bathtub. Um, and it, it basically just kind of like spirals out of control from there. Something that, that he does, which I think is hilarious after because before the episode starts, or, or when the episode starts, you see him fixing uh, something else from another person, you know, like, obviously, he's a handyman. And as soon as he's done, he gives everyone, like, an instant that he makes himself, and he literally tells him, he's like, I make this myself. And it's like a little instant. It looks like a joint, though, which is hilarious. But, um, you know, he goes to this lady's house to to fix her tub. He's able to fix her tub. And he notices that, like, there is some massive drama going on between her and, and some dude, um, which, you know, just from inferences, you can tell is like her boyfriend or something like that. But it's it's pretty hilarious seeing, you know, he's fixing the tub and he's hearing like their conversations um, over the phone. And it, it almost seems like it's just going to be a like a rough encounter and he finishes the bathtub, he leaves, and he hears, like, all the shenanigans that's happening. And he's sitting in his car, and, he, you know, he could have chosen to just leave and, and make life easy for himself. But he goes back into the apartment, he's like, hey, I left something here. And the lady's like, what did you leave? And he's like, it's something, you know. And he starts searching the apartment, just waiting for, you know, her boyfriend, this other person, to come. So the other person finally arrives, and it's just like chaos ensues you know for those you know like two minutes which is hilarious and you know the boyfriend and and the girl are just arguing back and forth back and forth and he's just kind of chilling they're trying to deflect all the situation and finally he offers them his incense and you know he lights it up and he's just like look this is calming and i make it myself which was just pretty funny and seeing like this big you know ginormous like burly man you know just lighting up a little instant to like calm the room down um overall though i think this this could end up being pretty hilarious um this watching it in a weird way reminded me of the apple show um shrinking i believe is the new one called where you just have like just a motley crew of people but they all gel together so well and i think that is what's going to make this show so good is that you literally are are going to have such different personalities, but yet they're able to gel and, and mend together and all of them have different humor, I guess you would, you know, you would call it like different personalities that just will work well together. Um, this is one of those also where I think it's just going to be a, a feel good show. Um, you know, definitely one to check out. I would highly recommend it. Uh, but yeah, this is Metal Man, and I would give this, you know, a, I would give this also an, an 8 out of 10. You know, the, all those shows that I've been able to see here from South by Southwest have all been extremely well. Uh, well made, well done, the acting is good in it, the humor doesn't feel forced. Um, so yeah, so this one's another, uh, another home run for me. You know, simple 8 out of 10. Um, definitely let me know what you guys think, let me know if you guys have seen this one or not. 
But on that note, this is Jorge from Team JVS, and we'll see you next time. Peace.